All right, more bootleg Lego. Um, the Spider-Man Far From Home stuff has been starting to make its way online. I know they're in production, and uh, there's still a Spider-Man Homecoming treat on the street as I pass through today. Um, it was the last one, and there's some new Avengers Infinity War stuff that they've put on the streets, and I will do my best to pick that up and show you, but... Uh, this is a pretty great figure, or a pretty great character. This was, uh, this is one of my favorite Marvel villains, the uh, Michael Keaton Vulture character. So, this was forty-five thousand Vietnam Dong, which is about two bucks, a little over two dollars. Um, Spider-Man Homecoming Lele, which I call it Lele, Lele, uh, Chinese bootleg Lego, fake Lego. Picture of the Vulture here. There he is. This is going to be pretty sweet. There's the business, the business end of that. Children are very curious. Learning inherent impulse to fight through a unique puzzle game inspired children's creativity and imagination. That's pretty close. Let children learn naturally, blending happy, accompany each child's stage of development, the ability to form a series of closely related and future growth. Uh, if anyone from Lale is watching this, I am happy to do some freelance proofreading on your translations. Just reach out to me, because that's pretty atrocious. Um, but it is what it is, man. So that's what it's supposed to look like. And uh, on the back here, the Spider-Man Homecoming midsize classics here. Uh, looks like the Ben Riley Scarlet Spider with some kind of monster machine there. Something that I probably should know. Um, the amazing Spider-Man there with a stoplight and some flames and then this uh, spider hover cart looking guy interesting so let's see how it looks Spider-Man Homecoming two years later alrighty Let's do it. Let's see how she looks. There he is. The vulture. Pretty neat. The wings bend. Nice work, fake Lego. Alright, adios.